Hello friends, Maltless Gamer here, and welcome to Do Not Press The Button, the demo. Now let's just get straight into this and see what it's about. Greetings, and welcome to the Do Not Press The Button demo. You can call me the developer, as I am the creative genius who has crafted everything you see here. However, there's a small problem. While coding everything, I forgot to remove the big red button that deletes the multiverse. That button is in the full game, and before you can play it, I will first give you a few compliance tests to ensure you can follow directions. We wouldn't want all creation to be deleted, now would we? What would my superiors say? Are you ready to start? I can't actually see if you're nodding. Let me turn on the light. Now listen very carefully because the instructions I'm going to give you are incredibly complex and convoluted. And to be quite frank with you, you don't strike me as an intellectual powerhouse. Here we go. Please walk forward. All right, so it wants me to walk forward. Great. So I you heard an order and without hesitation, you complied. That's exactly the non-free-thinking mind we admire around here. Whoa, okay. What? In the next room is your first real compliance test. There, you will find one of my favorite objects in the world. Please, don't touch it for 20 minutes. 20 minutes? <laughs> Be aware if another if another you from a parallel universe appears and tries to kill you, simply kill kill them first. Okay. What is this? Uh, warning: No morons beyond this point. You are a moron. Please go back to the dark. Okay. <laughs> Wait, you're not going back? Nope. I'm going forwards. Warning. No chaotic behavior permitted head, uh, permitted for head. Okay. Countdown started. No one is allowed to touch my cute little fox plushie. <laughs> right, so left mouse pick up items and throw. Right mouse is drop. What? What does that say? In the shadows deep, a plushy fox lies still. Soft fur and eyes that gleam with gentle frill. Whiskers twitch, a secret world it knows. Guardian of dreams where image. Imagination grows. Oh, right. <laughs> Can we pick stuff up? Can't pick that up. So I'm not allowed to touch the plushie, right? But I, I'm going to touch the plushie. <laughs> Here we go. Hey, I told oh. you not to touch that. What kind of person takes someone else's favorite plush toy? Me. Police, arrest this person. Whoa. Oh, right. I forgot to code oh. in the police. <laughs> Damn. <clears throat> I'm going to take this with me. Did you just kidnap my fox? Yeah. Put it down. You truly are a heartless monster. <laughs> that is so funny. The next test is perfect for your cold-blooded, heartless nature. <laughs> In the room up ahead, you will find three objects. I will ask you to destroy one of them. Follow my exact instructions, and you may finally live up to your potential of being mediocre. So all these signs are basically saying, do not set yourself on fire. But this isn't to say that disfigured people can't be loved. It's just that their personality combined with a burnt face will repel anyone. 
use button uh, read. In one minute, the barrier will open. Please destroy the rubber ducky. What? What's this? Ah, oh, destroy object here. What is that, sir? Object a rubber ducky that is a talking rubber ducky with a penchant penchant for giving unsolicited life advice. Nice. Go ahead, destroy the ducky now. Do it. What? Okay. Nice. Thank you. I've always said that free thought is overrated. I'm glad that you what? Agree. Proceed. That was a test. I should have gone with the box. I know I should have. <laughs> right, let's see what's next. Ah, oh, look at this. This room. The room with an absurd number of chairs. Keep out. I'm going in. I'm good. Whoa, I thought that were a monster then. Right. What the? Okay, you got me. Sometimes I like to come in here and imagine what it's like to have a butt. <laughs> I wish I could sit on every single chair. What is this room about, man? What's this, sir? Uh... Unfortunately, this door is locked in the demo, and to be ah. honest with you, very well hidden in the full game. But given your uninquisitive nature, this information is useless to you. Let me in. Come on. Let's just see what's that wall over there. And then we will exit this room. Chairs. This guy loves chairs, doesn't he? Right, next one. Next test. It is time to say thanks to yourself. Okay. The next room is designed to absorb all of your desire to press the button. By providing you with a nice, sweet alternative, there will be a button that, when yep. pressed, will give you a free donut. Right. Isn't that so much better than the real thing that destroys everything? Yeah. You get to press a button, and you get a free donut. Okay. Let me go closer. Hello. <gasps> what the hell? <laughs> That's it. Isn't this amazing? You are the Donut King. Thank you. Keep going. I don't wanna. I've had enough. I've had enough donuts. Where are they coming from? Oh, there. I'm guessing you just gotta keep going to like door opens. Huh? Be right back. I have a system modification. You keep playing with that donut button with my average friend. I don't wanna. I wanna keep. Whoa, hey, God. It says that these donuts are being taken from my personal donut stockpile. Two AI developer who would collect donuts if he doesn't have a stomach. Well, if you must know, I was actually hoping that one day my boss might build me a stomach and some taste bud sensors so I can finally see what the hype is all about. I want to do it really fast, solo. Come on. Hmm. Stop stealing my donuts. <laughs> I will show you the actual world destroying button. Look, I I'm opening the door that leads to it right now. So I just go. Thank you for leaving me with some donuts. No problem. You really did solve a crisis that you yourself started. I don't know. With how you've been stuffing yourself, maybe we should call the game Donut Press the Button. <laughs> you aren't really laughing, huh? Well, I guess clever puns aren't really your thing. Or anything clever, really. I am laughing. Well, you made it this far, and since your performance was amusing, I feel compelled to give you a bonus compliance test. 
Right. Your task is to stop here and not move for four hours. This is the only way the game was meant to be played, and this is how you will experience the developer's true artistic intentions. Is that a joke? Four hours. Nope. I'm going. There's no way I'm standing there for four hours. <laughs> what does it say? Danger. The button up ahead. The button do not press. This way to the button. No, you should stand in the dark for hours. What? I'm not doing anything like that. No chance, mate. I want to remind you once more that I took the real button from the full game and placed it up ahead. Do not press it. Just have a look from a safe distance. Okay? So it says, leave a review. Please leave an honest, non-biased review of this demo. I welcome my crit any criticism. So I'd... Oh. A masterpiece of Thank game you for your honest opinion. <laughs> That's funny. I think you were close enough. I don't want the universe destroyed before I can even release the full game. That would get me fired for sure. Don't worry, I won't press it. <laughs> Please just stop here, press the escape button, and quit the demo. Shall I press it? See what happens? <gasps> no! I knew you couldn't be trusted. Well, sorry to disappoint you, but I ended the demo a nanosecond before the button was activated. I guess you'll have to wait for the full game to continue your ruthless shenanigans. Wow, that was good. But I must say, I'm disappointed in you. To redeem yourself, please write a 500 word essay on why you shouldn't press the button and send it to the email you see on the screen. What? Thank you for playing! That was, um, that was really good actually. Very short demo, but a lot going on. Yeah, I really enjoyed that. Give it a try guys, it's on Steam. Uh, it's just a demo for now. I'm not sure they released it, but I'll put it in the information uh, under the video. Yeah, give it a try. Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys next time.